Welcome back to Engineering Graphics class. Today's session we are going to discuss how to solve the isometric projection problems using isometric sheet. And the, we will discuss the problem number 32. Here the following figure shows the uh, front and side view of a solid. Draw the isometric projection of the combination. By seeing this figure we can uh, analyze this. We have a two the rectangular slabs. One is placed horizontal and one is placed vertical. The vertical rectangle slab will have the dimension 45 and the width is 15 and the height is 60 and the bottom the horizontal slab it will have the 25 and the 15 and the length is 60 it is placed attached to the the 45 mm side face at the bottom and it is to be it is uh, it is to be kept uh, 10 mm apart from the side walls okay let me start this first we will construct the the vertical uh, slab that will have the dimension 45 and 15 height is 60 and we will take it here this side 45 should be placing on this side so we need to mark it from here 1 2 3 4 and 5 and then 15 1 and partial means 15 and then again if you come back 45 it will come to here and then join it and the height we know that 60 so from here we need to count the 60 1 2 3 4 5 6 same way from this corner also we can count it from here 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 and same way here also we need to count it 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 then join to the all the bottom corners okay finished okay next uh, we need to attach this one um, the rectangle slab horizontal one so the dimension we know that 25 is a uh, width and height is 15 the length is 60 and they it is uh, given that from the side wall it is having 10 mm so that's why we will start it from here from here 10 mm we will leave it and uh, from here we need to give the height 15 so one and off and same way here also from the side we can give it distance one a box that then then uh, here also one and off then we can join it to uh, top then uh, this length will become 25 by default it will come and now from all these four corners we need to take the 60 six boxes we need to move it uh, like here one two three four five six same way here also we can move it one 2 3 4 5 6 and from the top also we can move it here 1 2 3 4 5 6 and then from here also we can move it 1 2 3 4 5 6 after finishing this we need to join all the end points to get the final view okay we joined it and at the end we need to erase the the edges coming inside we need to erase it like this we need to erase whatever the portion coming inside and then uh, the problem is completed 